Today, crews have been busy getting uh, the, at the Phoenix Zoo, getting everything ready for the incredible zoo lights. Team 12's William Pitts is right there and uh, is looking at how things are coming along. Believe it or not, zoo lights is just a couple of weeks away and tickets are already on sale. Joaquin with the Phoenix Zoo, it's always a huge event, right? Yeah, it's the biggest event I like to think ever. It's the best thing to do in the holidays is spend time with us here at the zoo lights. Not only do you get to see all these amazing lights, but you get to see some of our beautiful critters too. And tell people what they can expect when they come here. I mean, obviously we've got the wolf pack behind us here, but what else do we have new this year? So you have your zoo lights, of course, but you have s'more pits. You have our glow garden, which is great for selfies, by the way. I know folks like taking their cameras and getting that beautiful color in their face. You'll have an illuminated dance floor. It's amazing. And of course, we also have animal presentations. And we've got this gigantic floating tree out here on the lake, which is amazing. I don't even know how you guys put that thing up. Yeah, so we actually craned that out there recently. We had a whole team of guys out there paddling their way, pushing it out there with little boats. But the big thing was the crane to get it onto the lake. And that, of course, will also be part of the Zoo Lights, a light show that'll be fluctuating every few minutes out there, along with the dancing trees in the background, background and the lit up pillars. Now, we've also got another event coming up even sooner than Zoo Lights, Roars and Pours. Tell me about that one. Yeah, so if you want a little taste of Zoo Lights, some of them are on for Roars and Pours. Not only can you taste zoo lights, but you can taste some of our amazing drinks because we do have sample tables out there and tables for uh, sale as well. Animal presentations that same day, but you can drink and we have adult themed presentations. So jokes are a little bit naughtier, a little bit more wild, I like to say. Um, <laughs> and we've got a beer that actually does some good too. Huss has brewed you a black footed ferret IPA, which I kind of want to try, honestly, but this helps you guys. Yeah, so this IPA that we just we just collaborated with, with Huss Brewing, has our black footed ferrets in the front of it. These guys are super amazing. Our ferrets are awesome. What we do here at the zoo is we breed them and then we send them out to another facility where they can then get released into the wild. And by purchasing these drinks, you can actually help the ferrets yourself. And tickets online, right? You yeah. can buy tickets for both of these. Tickets are on sale now for both Zoo Lights and Roars and Pours. However, Roars and Pours is this Thursday, so come check us out. All right, not a whole lot of time for Roars and Pours, but still a lot of time for Zoo Lights. Tickets on sale now and again starts at the end of November. Definitely come out, check out all of the new things going on here at the zoo. You can hear the flamingos going on behind me. They're excited for it too. Well, Evan Phoenix, William Pitts, 12 News. All right, Will, one of my girl's favorite holiday traditions out there at the zoo. Thank you.